checks complete. Everyone be aware, we've got a car leaving the garage. Just ahead, push for that position. Jamie's behind you. Okay, we've got four laps of fuel remaining. Right, let's have you in at the end of this lap, please. Okay, just two laps of fuel remaining now. Okay, science is behind you. for tomorrow's race but before we begin let's have a quick look at those who'll be fronting the grid surfer girl Drogovic, and lando norris well that wraps up qualifying but don't worry we'll be back tomorrow as we head into the grand prix so it's all about speed in today's sprint not very many laps and no chance to get ahead on strategy who here today has the raw skill to take them to the top.
fantastic qualifying session, it's time to see how our starting grid looks for today's sprint. Surfer Girl lines up on pole position, and Felipe Drogovic completes the front row. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Norris, Liam Lawson, Russell, Sainz, Albon, Leclerc, Gasly, Sonoda, Oscar Piastri, Theo Porcher, Stroll, Halger, Chadwick, Yuri Vips, Duan, Ocon, De Vries, Sargent, Magnussen, and Tatiana Calderon. Which of these drivers will get pole position today? We'll soon find out. The formation lap is underway ahead of today's sprint. We're almost ready to start the sprint as the cars take their positions on the grid, with the drivers and teams making their final preparations. teammate by 2.8 seconds. They're on fresh softs. They're in 11th. Let's use overtake and burn off some of this energy. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 5.9 seconds. They're on fresh softs. The last lap time was a 1 minute 15.8. The underbody's taken a little damage, just watch out for it. No need to worry about the tyre condition for now, everything's looking good. The underbody's taken a little damage, just watch out for it. 
Okay, DRS will be enabled this lap. You can use it when you're within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 8.7 seconds. They're all fresh softs. Time last lap was a Rain is forecast in just over 10 minutes time. Rain in 10 minutes. Okay, so we're leaving our teammate by 10.2 seconds. Norris is behind you. They're all fresh softs. Their tyres are three laps old. The car behind has front wing damage. It will have a harder time keeping up with you, so keep pushing. And the time last lap was a 1 minute 08.5. Okay, we've got a full course caution. The safety car's out. Keep an eye on the delta. We need to keep it positive to avoid a penalty. Slow down, maintain positive delta. play this right, we can get a nice advantage here. Let's have a think about how we handle the rest of this race. Good to get back on track. Let's make the best of this restart. Let's go. Okay, conditions are going to keep deteriorating for 10 minutes at least. Okay, dry seem like the best tyre for now. Be careful on those slicks. These conditions are making the line a bit greasy, but we're still nowhere near the changeover point. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 33.6 seconds. They're all fresh softs. They're in 15th. Okay, we think the underbodies incurred some slight damage, but nothing too serious at the moment. Just be careful. Okay, clear. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 9.4 seconds. They're all fresh softs. They're in 11th. The last lap time was a 1.24.5. Right, drop your speed. Our delta's too low and we're going to risk a penalty. Slow your pace immediately. The tyre situation's pretty touch and go right now. We think the slicks may still be quicker, but it's very close, and you're going to struggle to keep them in the temperature window. The inters are ready for whenever you need them. We're not certain which is the best tyre right now, dries or inters. Pitting this lap then, come into the pits at the end of this lap. We don't have the data for that, I'm afraid. 
OK, we'll fit inters on your next stop. Green flag. OK, it's borderline, mate, but if I were you, I'd come in and change tyres. I'm just not sure we're on the right ones for these conditions anymore. The car behind is Lawson. Less than a second separates you. They're on fresh softs. Their tyres are two laps old. We think they've got one more stop. Time last lap was a 1 minute 20.6. Okay, Jamie's in the pits. Jamie is in the pits now. Okay, go, go, go. Perfect job from you and the crew there, mate. We're delighted with that. Up to speed now. Let's get some heat into those tyres. OK, so we're leading our teammate by 9.8 seconds. They're on a fresh set of inters. Sonoda's ahead of you. OK, gap ahead is 1.1 seconds. They're on a fresh set of inters. Their tyres are just one lap old, and the time last lap was a 132.5. Right, we need to get past here, use overtake, use overtake. Four shares ahead of you, and gap to the car in front is 1.0 seconds. They're on a fresh set of inters. Your last lap time was a 1 minute 33.0. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 13.0 seconds. Sonoda's behind you. Our gap behind is 1.2 seconds. They're on a fresh set of inters. Their tyres are two laps old. Time last lap was a 1.16.3. OK, Sainz is ahead of you. OK, so the gap to the car ahead, 4.0 seconds. They're on a fresh set of inters. Their tyres are three laps old. And the time last lap was a 1 minute 16.5.
Okay, you've just started the final lap of the race. Final lap. Let's have a quick look at how the driver's standings have changed. Surfer Girl increases their championship lead. The grid is set then, so that just leaves the race itself. Join us tomorrow where we'll be live with all the action. And until then, goodbye. This is it then, race day in Spielberg for this year's Austrian Grand Prix. Not long to go before our drivers hurtle off the line and into the first turn, the Nicky Lauda Curve. It was renamed in 2019 in memory of one of Formula One's most beloved figures. The Spielberg circuit then is situated 700 metres above sea level, with just 10 corners making up one of the shortest laps of the season. One time around here is a distance of around 2.6 miles, with the best overtaking chances into turn one or the tight uphill of turn three. Before we begin, let's take a quick look at the grid lineup for today's race. An immense lap from Carlos Sainz yesterday puts him in pole position, and Surfer Girl completes the front row. As we continue through the rest of the grid today, we have Sonoda, Teo Porsche, Liam Lawson, Russell, Stroll, Leclerc, Halga, Gasly, De Vries, Chadwick, Calderon, Ocon. Magnussen, Oscar Piastri, Norris, Albon, Yuri Vips, Drogovic, Dewan, and Logan Sargent. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out then. Let's see who can prevail today. Anthony Davidson joins me once again in the commentary box, and it's fantastic to have you with us here. But I'm curious, as a man with experience out on the track, how do you stop those pre-race nerves from becoming overwhelming when you're lining up on the grid? Well, I imagine they'll be starting to feel the adrenaline as they anticipate the rundown into Turn 1, a bit like preparing to go into battle. The unknown situation will bring nerves, but that's a good thing. It will keep them focused on the moment and on their surroundings as we build towards the start of the Grand Prix. Formation lab gets underway then and it's going to be interesting today to see how the dry conditions could affect the lifespan of the tyres. As the cars come back towards the grid to line up for the start of the race, each driver will be wanting to get the best start they possibly can and they'll be hoping to finish today's race on the podium failing that within the points.
science behind you now. Okay, the car behind has front wing damage, front wing damage. This is our opportunity. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 2.4 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. They're in 10th place. Got a lot of spare energy, okay to use your overtake button. DRS is now available. No rain expected, no rain expected for the time being. Drys definitely seem like the fastest tyre at the moment. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 9.2 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. The last lap time was a 1.12.6. So we're leading our teammate by 8.3 seconds.
Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 8.7 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. They're in 10th place. Time last lap was a 1 minute 11.0. Sonoda behind. Okay, the gap is less than a second. Okay, they're on old softs. We think they've got one more stop. And the time last lap was a 110.3. On him, he might make a mistake. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by four point three seconds. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 4.8 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. The last lap time was a 1 minute 10.2.
share behind you now. Okay, they're on old softs. Their tyres are nine laps old. We think they've got one more stop. The car behind has front wing damage. It will have a harder time keeping up with you, so keep pushing. Time last lap was a 110.3. Battery charge is high, let's use that overtake button a bit more. Okay, this is Mark. I need you to stop cutting the corners. If you keep it up, the stewards are going to give you a penalty. Okay, Sonoda's behind you. Less than a second separates you. Okay, they're on old softs. Their tyres are 11 laps old now. We think they've got one more stop. For the time last lap was a 1 minute 10.3. Leclerc is behind you. Okay, the gap behind is 2.0 seconds. Okay, they're on old softs. Their tyres are 11 laps old now. We think they've got one more stop. Your last lap time was a 1.10.4. We're approaching the pit window and you're going to be on mediums. You only have to stop once now, one stop left, and your pit window opens in two laps time. Tire condition still looking good. Threat of rain for the time being, conditions look good. Okay, dry seem like the best tyre for now. We're going to 
box this lap, push hard on the in lap. Okay, we're monitoring somewhere on the internal combustion engine. Be aware that we're going to start to see a loss of power. Okay, let's go now, come on. Perfect job on the turn in there, mate. Looks like a nice stop time. We're happy with that one. That was our last stop. No more scheduled pit stops, let's go. Calderon's ahead. Okay, they're on old softs. Okay, they've done 15 laps on those tires. We think they've got one more stop. Time last lap was a one minute, 12.3. trailing our teammate by 15.5 seconds. They're on old mediums. They're in first. And the time last lap was a 110.8. And the gap behind us is 2.1 seconds. behind's just boxed for mediums. Car behind on the medium tyre now. Green flag. Sonoda behind. We're leading the car behind by 3.1 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. That's Vips ahead now. Okay, keep an eye on that gap ahead, please. 2.4 seconds. They're on old mediums. Their tyres are 17 laps old. We think they've got one more stop. They seem to have an issue. Their last lap time was a 1 minute 10.9. Okay, radar is clear, weather is looking good for now. Drys definitely seem like the fastest tyre at the moment. Let's use overtake and burn off some of this energy. Right, Jamie's coming in for a stop.
Porsche is ahead. Okay, here's the gap that we're trailing the car ahead by. 4.2 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. Their tyres are eight laps old. Time last lap was a 109.3. Okay, so they're extending their advantage by two seconds a lap at the moment. Maneuver. You made it look so easy. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 8.4 seconds. Okay, they're on fresh hards. They're in 10th place. The last lap time was a 109.2. Okay, safety car deployed, safety car's been deployed. Watch your Delta, make sure you keep it positive as we catch the pack. Poor share is the car behind you. Okay, the gap is less than a second. They're on old mediums. Their tyres are 12 laps old. We think they've got one more stop. The car behind us has significant damage to its front wing and is going to be losing downforce. Time last lap was a 1 minute 0 0.0. Okay, slow down, slow down. Your delta's negative, which means you're going too fast. Reduce your pace. Okay, expect to see some rain about 10 to 15 minutes from now. So we're expecting rain in about 10 to 15 minutes. Okay, dry seem like the best tyre for now. Okay, fitting intermediate tyres next. Thank you. 
let's get ready to go racing again. The safety car is in this lap. When the field accelerates, remember, there's no overtaking until the timing line. Safety car in this lap. Okay, clear. got a lot of spare energy, okay to use your overtake button. Rain is forecast in just over 10 minutes time. Rain in 10 minutes. Dry has definitely seem like the fastest tire at the moment. Okay, safety car deployed. Safety car's been deployed. Watch your delta. Make sure you keep it positive as we catch the pack. The safety car's out. We need you to reduce your pace. It looks like there's a high amount of debris on the track. Be careful. The underbody's taken some damage. Expect some significant impact to performance, I'm afraid. Okay, no issues with tyre wear for now. Keep taking care of them. You're approaching the safety car, you're leading, so don't pass it. Stay behind the safety car. might see some rain, ETA about 15 minutes.
car is in this lap. Safety car in this lap. You'll be controlling the pace on the restart. Keep it steady until the safety cars reach the pit lane. OK, expect to see some rain about 10 to 15 minutes from now. OK, dry seem like the best tyre for now. OK, so we're leaving our teammate by 3.3 seconds. Okay, clear. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 1.5 seconds. Okay, they're on fresh hearts. They're in ninth place. And the time last lap was a 1.12.7. a few lap outs yet but it is coming so be careful drives definitely seem like the fastest tire at the moment drs has been enabled drs is now enabled Okay, so we're leaving our teammate by 5.2 seconds. Okay, they're on fresh hards. The last lap time was a 1 minute 10.7. Expecting some rain soon, expect the first drops in the next few minutes.
Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 3.3 seconds. Okay, we're looking at some gearbox wear, so try to keep the number of shifts to a minimum, please. Okay, this is your final lap, final lap of the race. We don't think it's gonna stay dry for much longer. The rain could come at any moment, so watch out. Okay, dry seem like the best tire for now. Fantastic drive, that's just fantastic. Amazing, you deserve that race win. Well done, mate. It wasn't always plain sailing today, but it was a very important win nonetheless. Well, Anthony Davidson, a resounding victory today, but what set them apart from the rest? Well, time management probably played quite a large role in the outcome of this one. As ever, it's not just about speed, it's all about maintaining that speed consistently over a stint, over a race distance. So being able to keep up the lap times while still being smooth on the controls and gentle on the tyres, that's really where the race was won today. A show-stopping performance from the three drivers approaching the podium right now. It's been an interesting Grand Prix, that's for sure. Review the driver's standings. Surfer Girl increases their championship lead. Now, let's discuss Ant. Who would you say is a contender for driver of the day? I have to give it to Surfer Girl. It's time to see how things are shaping up in the Constructors' Championship. The owner driver's team moved to the top of the table. Meanwhile, good work from Aston Martin this weekend, who pushed themselves further up the order. And with that, we wrap up another weekend of motorsport action. But with more races lined up, be sure to join us when we come back with more Formula One.